this is Lucas. And uh, I want to show this little uh, jet 9x20 lathe. Uh, it's got a, a part number, I think it's a BD920N, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, BD920N. Uh, it's probably, this is 2013, it's probably like 10 years old. So, you know, maybe like 2003 vintage. Anyway, uh, it's a nice little lathe, man. It cuts great. Right now we got our uh, we got her set up with a piece of steel in the uh, three jaw, and uh, we're going to run a, a carbide tool on it. And I'm very impressed actually with the with the way it performs. The lathe is great. It's 110 volt lathe. Uh, it's got uh, all the uh, standard things a uh, you know, jet of this vintage would have. Uh, it's got a uh, belt tensioning uh, device back here, and uh, all the outboard gear stuff is. Uh, is working on everything's working on it, so it's almost like a brand new lathe. Um, got all the uh, just about everything that came with it new. Another nice thing is it's got the modification to the uh, bolt down, the uh, the compound bolt uh, bolting system. So this is the stock uh, stock one, pretty flimsy. Let's take a look here at the uh, at the one that's been actually added to this lathe. So uh, this is it. It's actually got four bolts. So there's one here, one here, there's one underneath the uh, compound, uh, and then one here. So, uh, boy, it's really rigid. Uh, it's got a decent tool post on it. This is the uh, tool post that it came with uh, from the factory, and uh, it actually works pretty well. So you can see I've got this chunk of carbide in here. We're going to face this, and then we're going to turn it. All right, uh, it's got a new uh, tailstock chuck, drill chuck. And uh, it's got a quick change gearbox and all the threads. So it'll go from 8 threads per inch to 56. So uh, 0 0.5, 0 0.7, 0 0.75, 0 0.8, 1, 1 1.25, 1.5, 1.752, 2.5, and, and 3. And I believe that that's the, the uh, uh, pitch for the, uh, the metric threads. So, okay. All right. So let's, uh, let's fire this bad boy up, see how it cuts. Nice and smooth, work great. Uh, we'll show the uh, the next one will be the uh, turning cut, and we'll actually engage the feed for that one. That's about zero. I'm gonna go ahead and pick this up. It's about uh, oh, better part of of a turn. So we're going to take a caliper here now and uh, to show how much uh, we've taken off. So the uh, going to zero it. So you've taken off about uh, 70 thousandths on the diameter, so about 35 thousandths on the radius. In, uh, in one cut and uh, this is this is not a inserted carbide it's a cemented carbide it's just uh, really really working well and the, the uh, surface finish on this is very nice and it works really well I turned this one down this morning and again that just looks great so that's a little lathe in operation uh, it is a jet BD920N and uh, you know the, the door latch works. It's got an extra shelf down below, a factory stand, factory base cabinet. I'm guessing that's a at least a three hundred dollar option on this. Uh, so uh, nice little lathe. It seems to work great. Got a lot of capability. It is a reversing uh, it's a reversing motor, and uh, it's a one and a half by eight thread per inch spindle nose under here. And uh, hardened ways, all the ways are hardened. Uh, I don't believe the undersides are hardened, but the tops, all of these uh, flat ways and prismatic ways are all hardened. Hey, this is Lucas, signing off.